refuting Islam in less than 60 seconds. Let's go. Okay, so the Quran is a clear book. These verses clearly say that the Torah and the Injil are authoritative, inspired, and preserved to the Christians and Jews. If the Quran preserves the previous scriptures, then we should find that they are completely in agreement. So here is where Islam refutes itself. Islam makes claims about Jesus, for example, that he never died in the flesh, he was never crucified in Surah 4, Ayah 157, that contradicts almost everything that you can find in the Gospels. What this means is that the Quran does not actually agree with the previous scriptures, even though it claims to preserve them. If the Injil and the Torah were corrupted, then where were the original followers of Jesus? who supposedly were rightly guided and will be forever above the disbelievers until the day of resurrection. Can you point me to a single follower of Jesus who correctly understood the Injil before it was corrupted? You can't, because there is none.